Hey guys, it's David from TheUnlocker.com and today we have a root app or root tweak for you. Um, this one is going to show you how you can back up and even sync all of your apps and all of their data on your Android device. Okay, in order to do this procedure, you must be rooted. If you aren't, you can head to our rooting how to section by clicking the link below. Uh, pick the manufacturer you have, pick the device you have, pick the latest how to root method for your device, finish that and then return here to continue. Okay, first we're going to go to the Play Store. And then we're going to search for Helium. Tap on that one. Then tap Install, Accept, and wait for that to install. Once that's installed, you're going to hit Open. Uh, it's going to ask you if you want to log into your Google account. You can click OK. Tap your Google account. And now you're logged in. Then it'll check for root permissions. Click Grant when that comes up, and we're now in the app. So you can either select uh, the different things like the Wi-Fi connection settings, your SMSs, your text messages, your user dictionary, or the individual apps. You can do this one at a time if you really wanted to, or you can pull this up from the bottom and tap Select All to just grab everything, and you'll see them all listed in here. You can even tap in here to unselect a few if you can managed to get in there easily enough. Uh, the app data only, basically this, if it's checked, which it is by default, it'll only back up the app data. When you do restore all of these apps, it's going to ask you to individually download them. It'll kind of do it automatically, but you will have to be prompted and push buttons um, to download all of those apps back from the Play Store. If you uncheck that, it'll actually save the app itself, um, which makes for a much larger backup file, but in my opinion, is worth it. Um, and is also, I believe, a feature only of root devices. Now, you can name this, so we're going to call this Essentials, or whatever else you want to call it. And you can create a bunch of different groups if you felt like it um, for different parts of the app. And when you go to different devices, you can load them on you know, differently. Uh, and then whenever you're ready, you're just going to hit Backup. Uh, then you can install this to the internal storage, which is what the free version will have you do. Um, you can also do your Google Drive or any other cloud storage like uh, Box um, or Dropbox. So, uh, but those, the, the cloud storage requires that you have the premium version, which costs money. Um, it is worth it, though, in my opinion, because to be able to do that means you can also automatically sync back from that. If something happens to your internal storage, you don't have to worry about losing the backups. You can always just grab them from your Google Drive or wherever. Um, he's also managed to put schedule backups, so this will automatically backup, which means you'll never have to worry about doing this again. Um, it'll just automatically save all of them and rewrite the last one. Um, but because we're using the free version, and just for demonstration's sake, we're going to do internal storage. Um, and then wait for it to back everything up. Once the backup is complete, you're all set. You now have a saved group you'll see there. Um, let's say you flashed a custom ROM or you did something else and you started back over with this device. You can just reinstall Helium, go to Restore and Sync, uh, and then tap whatever device it was from or your internal storage in this case. Tap your saved group and then tap Restore to get all of your apps back and all of their data and everything back the way that it was. Um, also keep in mind what I said about the paid version which will allow you to sync pretty much automatically with uh, a cloud storage um, and also across different devices, which is pretty neat, I believe. So check it out. Tell us if you like it. Leave us a, a note in the comment or um, on our site and uh, enjoy. And there you go. I hope that helped some of you. And if you'd like to check out some of our other tips and tricks or other how-to videos, feel free to follow me on Twitter, Facebook, Google+, or subscribe to our YouTube channel.